Hello, dear explorers. Welcome to Train Your Brain. This is a place where we explore, discover, and learn together in a fun, engaging, and easy to understand way. Endless curiosity. Each topic hides something special, so stay with us and uncover the world of knowledge. In this first season, I have prepared over 200 incredibly interesting videos covering various topics about our bodies, history, natural disasters, space exploration, animals and much, much more. These videos are made to inspire both young and older explorers alike. And now it's time to start. Today I have something really special for you. Are you ready? Let's dive into the first topic. The water cycle, nature's amazing water adventure. Did you know that water is always moving around in a big cycle? It's true. This cycle is called the water cycle and it's like a never-ending adventure for water. The water cycle starts when the sun shines its warm rays down onto the earth. This heat makes some of the water in rivers, lakes and oceans evaporate into the air. Evaporation is when water turns into invisible vapor. Once the water vapor is in the air, it rises up and forms clouds. These clouds float around in the sky, carrying water from one place to another. When the clouds get heavy with water, they release it as rain, snow or hail. This process is called precipitation. When the rain falls, it soaks into the ground or flows into rivers and streams. Some of it even goes back into the oceans. This water then starts the cycle all over again by evaporating into the air when the sun heats it up. The water cycle is important because it helps plants grow, fills up our rivers and lakes and gives us water to drink. Without the water cycle, our planet wouldn't be able to support life as we know it. So, the next time you see rain falling from the sky or feel the warmth of the sun, remember that you are witnessing a part of nature's amazing water adventure, the water cycle. I hope you enjoyed this part. Let me know in the comments if it was already familiar to you. Now let's explore something new. In the next video, you will find even more fascinating facts, so stay with us. Thank you for watching and don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel and share it with your friends. Weather Wonders – Exploring the signs of rain, snow and thunderstorms Did you know? The weather around us is always changing and there's a lot of science behind it. Let's dive into the fascinating world of weather patterns and learn about some cool phenomena like rain, snow and thunderstorms. First up, rain. Raindrops form when tiny droplets of water in the clouds come together and get heavy enough to fall to the ground. 
Rain is essential for plants to grow and keep our rivers and lakes full of water. Next, let's talk about snow. Snowflakes are like tiny ice crystals that form in the clouds when the air is very cold. When enough snowflakes come together, they create a beautiful blanket of snow on the ground. Snow is not only fun to play in, but also important for helping plants and animals survive during the cold winter months. And who doesn't love a good thunderstorm? Thunderstorms happen when warm, moist air rises high into the sky and meets cooler air. This collision creates lightning and thunder along with heavy rain and sometimes even hail. Thunderstorms can be powerful and exciting to watch, but it's essential to stay safe indoors when they happen. Understanding weather patterns helps us prepare for different types of weather and stay safe when they occur. Scientists use special tools like weather satellites and radar to study weather patterns and make forecasts to predict what the weather will be like. So, the next time you see raindrops falling from the sky or snowflakes dancing in the air, remember the science behind this amazing weather phenomena. It's all part of the fascinating world of weather patterns. Isn't it amazing how much we can learn about the world around us? But we are not done yet. Up next is another exciting topic you may already know about it, or it might be completely new to you. Let's find out! Understanding floods – keeping our environment safe Did you know, sometimes when it rains a lot, water can fill up the land and cause floods. Floods are when water spreads out and covers areas that are usually dry. Floods can happen near rivers, lakes, or even in cities where there's a lot of concrete and not enough places for the water to go. When floods occur, they can damage homes, roads and even hurt people and animals. But guess what? We can help prevent floods by taking care of our environment. When we throw trash on the ground, like plastic bags and bottles, it can clog up drains and rivers. This makes it harder for water to flow away when it rains and it can cause floods. So, what can we do to keep our environment safe and prevent floods? We can start by not littering and always putting our trash in the right place, like a trash can or recycling bin. We can also plant trees and create green spaces to help absorb rainwater and prevent flooding. By working together and taking care of our environment, we can help keep our communities safe from floods and create a cleaner, healthier planet for everyone to enjoy. Let's do our part to protect our environment and prevent floods. And that's all for today. I hope you had fun and learned something new. Don't forget to like this video, share it with your friends and subscribe to this channel. Train Your Brain is a channel when you will find new, exciting and educational content. Let's make learning fun. Stay curious, keep exploring and see you in the next video. Your ideas are always welcome, so leave a comment and let me know what topics you would like to see next. Thank you for watching and see you soon!